Christine Faring from Faring's at Ritz Carlton in Dallas and the new cookbook. Yeah. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> yes. what, what a labor of love, but a labor, a lot of work goes into that that a lot of us don't appreciate. Absolutely. Well, cooking now is such a big deal. I mean, and cooking at home is even a bigger deal because everyone has these great kitchens out yeah. there. Right, right. You know, and, and it's a status to have good equipment I mean, and you want good equipment you want it to look pretty whenever yeah. you present something to your family or friends <laughs> right. that have come over so what are you making today well this is a east texas field pea salad okay. we have a uh, great east texas field peas uh delicious already cooked uh great to cook them in a stock with a little seasoning to it okay. is perfect you can definitely do water uh salt uh just get them cooked. Okay. That's the best part. Then we're going to add a good little apple smoked bacon. Oh, must you. Oh, yes. Along with some fresh thyme. Carrots already cooked. Of course, we got to have a little spice of life jalapenos. These are diced, a little tiny. Diced, I like that. so okay. that it's all bite-sized. Okay. Lauren, that's great. And uh, cooked onions. And how about a little celery root? Then the trick is a little barbecue Thousand Island dressing. And that is taking your favorite barbecue sauce with a regular Thousand Island and putting that together. Oh. You just marry the two? You could uh, marry could, the two. Uh, you wouldn't be embarrassed to do that out of a bottle. You could do it out of a bottle. I'm sure you don't. I don't no, know. we make our own. It's probably <laughs> special, but yeah. But, you know, it, it can be done at home, but it adds a great summertime flavor to this salad. I Look love the that. carrots and the colors. <laughs> right, That's and pretty. it's all just perfect. And on heirloom tomatoes, is that These right? are from Keller, Texas, right there. A little arugula. And then let's put this right here in the middle. That's beautiful. Isn't that fun? And it, look how simple it is, but how delicious it can be. And you can say that Dean Farron gave you the recipe. Yes. <laughs> how cool will you sound? Right. And let's talk a little <laughs> bit about the cookbook. Uh, as we said, a lot of work. But you really got to take advantage of everything from down in the valley. Down in the valley. East coast. Texas farms, West Texas ranchers. Well, Texas is such a melting pot that the Texas Food Bible fits into all of that. We have everything. We have Louisiana flavors, Mexican flavors, Southern flavors, smoked barbecue grill. Wow. And frequently they work well together, too. You can take something from East Texas or something from South Texas, put oh, it together. And absolutely. It. And voila, there you go. Here we Perfect. Go. The well, Texas Food Thank Bible. you so much. Yes, the, uh, we have this recipe and also uh, more information about the Texas Food Bible on our website, myfoxcfw.com. Thank you so much.